Hey guys, what's going on? Kelly here, and I have another Would You Rather. Every Friday I have a Would You Rather with Mr. I Try Hard. Would you like to say hello? What's up, Kelly, and what's up, Kelly's channel? Good to be here again for, like, what, the fifth time now? Yeah, I think it's, like, our fifth one. I don't know, whatever. You guys are really enjoying this series. I know a million of you always ask me, like, why isn't there a Would You Rather today? Because it's every Friday. <laughs> so every Friday you can be sure that um, we'll upload a Would You Rather. Yep. Best day of the week. Hells yes. All right, so let's get it started. And the first question, would you rather steal from an old lady or laugh at a crippled person who has fallen and can't get up? <sighs> See, the old lady thing, I get something out of it, right? I get money. Yeah, I mean, you get whatever you steal from her. Yeah, old ladies are usually rich. That's just the way it works. I don't know, and, aren't uh, they kind of poor? Uh, I don't know. Well, okay, well, let's just say it's random, but... <sighs> I guess you wouldn't target a poor-looking old lady. you probably target the one that looks rich. Probably, like, the one with, like, the big jewels and stuff. But, uh... Yeah. uh you see, I'd probably get more hate if I laughed at a crippled dude. But, man... See... Oh, this is one... Oh, man. See? No, I'm, go I'm gonna steal from an old lady. Yeah, I am. Just because I'm a money whore, and uh, I love getting that money, so I'm going to target that rich bitch, and I'm going to steal her, and she's got nothing to do with it, and uh, I'll be rich. And you know what? I'll just... Yeah, no. Not, I'm, I'm not going to mess with that cripple, bro, because uh, I love cripple people. Those people are nice. See, I don't like. I don't want to sound like an asshole when I say this, but like there have been times when like I, I played sports like when I was growing up, and, like, there have been times when, like, in a softball game, a girl got hurt, and I, like, she fell really bad, and I'd, like, I'd have to hide my laughter. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And, like, I don't, like, I don't mean to laugh, but sometimes I genuinely, like, if it's really bad, like, if I see a fucked up video on the internet, and it looks like someone really got hurt, then I won't laugh, and I'll be really shocked and, like, want to cry. But, like, if it doesn't look that bad, like, if they've just fallen and it's something, like, they can't get up... <laughs> I want to laugh, so I feel like I'd laugh anyways. Like, I wouldn't be able to stop myself yeah. from accidentally laughing at the crippled person. Like, I'd, I'd try to hide it. <laughs> Are you picturing a crippled person not being able to get back on his wheelchair right now? Yeah. That's what I'm doing. I kind of picture them, like, rolling into cement and then falling <laughs> oh into God. the cement. Do you have any idea the comments we're going to get on this video? I don't know. <laughs> and, and, I mean, if you guys are crippled, like, we're not making fun of crippled people. It's just, like, this was just the question I found. I it's mean, I'd like, laugh at anyone who fell. It doesn't matter if they're crippled or not. If someone falls, I'm going to laugh at them. It's like a midget not being able to grab something because it's too high for him. That's <laughs> just hilarious. Oh, God. <laughs> this is so bad. Um, but, yeah, I don't think I'd steal from the old lady. Because then, I, I don't know, I feel like she might have a heart attack, and then I have that on my conscience, like, oh, shit, I killed that bitch. Whereas, you know, the crippled person, I can laugh at them, and then I can go help them up. You know why not? Well, oh, like, you saved that one really well, Kelly. Good job. Yeah. So. <laughs> That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to laugh at them and then help them up. Be like, oh, it happens to us all. all you know, right. try to, like, you know, wave it off for them so they're not too embarrassed. <laughs> <laughs> right after you've pointed and ridiculed them, you exactly. just go and help them. All right, that works. It's not like I'm going to be like, ah, ha, ha, you crippled bitch. Like, I'm not going to do that, but. All right. <laughs> all right. Okay, okay. Right. Would you rather date someone who is half human, half horse, or half human, half couch? <laughs> Which half? Um, I'm gonna assume that their their torso is bottom what's half. there. Ugh. So like the bottom half is the couch, the bottom half uh bottom half is the horse. Either which whichever one you choose. You wanna go first on this one? Yeah, sure. Um I'm definitely not gonna choose the horse because um that's that's fucking scary. I know on like a PK they linked a horse porno and it's it scarred me for life. <laughs> And I don't ever want that shit to happen to me. So I would definitely not choose that one. I'd okay. choose the couch. Like, what the hell? Like, you just, you know, sit on them and it'd be fine. It'd you be could comfortable. Game on yeah, him. you could game on him. And it would be great. You know, it'd just be nice and cuddly. And I'm going to assume it'd be a really nice couch, like leather. And yeah, I don't know. I'd choose that one. I like your idea, and it makes a lot of sense. Oh, can I choose if it's a like it's 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 gonna be a female, right? It's not gonna be a. Oh right? yeah, yeah. I mean, yeah, even if human, it's a horse, your right? Choice. Yeah, it's your choice. Okay, so yeah, I'm not even sure why I 
tried to clarify that. But uh, so okay, I'm I'm gonna go ahead and choose the horse because I've always you know I could ride my horse and then oh, I could fuck I my horse. Oh, I about that. Yeah, Shit. yeah. I could ride the horse. Nah, just get a car. I could ride the horse and I could fuck the horse too. Yeah, see, wow. it's easier for you. It, yeah, it is. It is. See, because then you just get, like, fucking devoured by the horse if ever you tried to have sex with it. But Ugh. I'm going to go with the horse, man. You, you know, I have a really nice couch here, and I'm, I'm really happy with it. And besides, I think the porn, like, just just the porn I could have with the half horse, half woman. Like, I have, I have the tits, I have the mouth of a woman, and then I have the huge vagina of a horse. And I can ride it. It, it's 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 like a win 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 that situation. That would be an awesome porn. <laughs> I'm, I'm I'm like riding it, like jumping hurdles, and then I like slip back down, like grabbing on. To, oh, like, and you're the... still jump, like she's still jumping yes! hurdles, and you're just yes! right, like fucking but it. I'm like I'm ramming it. Yeah, no, no, no. This is this is a gimme right here. <laughs> I'm I'm choosing the horse. Give give me the horse. Yeah, I guess I could go that way too, but I don't want to go through that pain. Like I know, yeah, I no. can't Ho- do it. Have you ever seen a horse's dick? Is this just oh. like, no? <laughs> All right. Let's just get away from that. <laughs> All right. Would you rather have sex with the Tin Man from Wizard of Oz or the Scarecrow from Wizard of Oz? God. Uh, yeah, I mean. I'm going to go with the Tin Man. And I'll tell you why. Um, he, he, <laughs> there's only really one real reason why I chose the Tin Man. It's because he has lube. Cause, cause, because he's made out of tin, right? Yeah. So, so, so he has to have lube, right, just to keep himself lubed up. So I feel like if he would be less um, damaging to my interior organs, compared to like a tin man, I don't know, like a tin man, I feel, uh, not, not a tin man, I'm sorry, but a scarecrow. scarecrow. Yeah, it's just, it's made out of like, like it's, it's straw, I guess. And I feel like then, you'd break it. I like feel like if it him. would hurt, like, have you ever, like, played with a stick? Like, just like a wooden, like, Oh, yeah, stick? and you'll get, like, splinters. Yeah, you get, like, splinters, and, like, it's not really all that straight. I feel like if it would hurt me more. Tin Man would be, like, just a nice, straight silver cock, and then he should lube that up. I-, I think it would be less damaging for my asshole. Just saying. Yeah, I'm actually going to go the same way. Uh, I just think, and the Scarecrow, like, for all your reasons, too, and then the Scarecrow, I just feel like he'd be a major bitch. Like, not, like, in a mean way, but, like, like he'd be a pussy. Like, there's nothing to him. Yeah, yeah, he was a pussy in that movie, too. No, wasn't that the line? I think they were all pretty much pussies. Yeah, they were. So, yeah, fuck all of them. But, yeah, I'd choose a Tin Man. He's way better. He looks more, like, I don't know, down for it. Whereas the Scarecrow just looks like he wants to cuddle. I don't know. Yep. Angry sex with a Tin Man. Yeah, that would be another good porno. You could have your half woman, <laughs> half horse in it too. Uh, Just have like a gangbang. <laughs> <laughs> riding, riding my bitch horse with a tin man. Yes. Oh my god, that is amazing. All right. Would you rather have snow globes for breast? Like, let's imagine you have boobs. Would okay. you rather have snow globes for breasts or magic eight balls? Oh god, can I have both? Like, <laughs> you know, like one of each. Wouldn't that be awesome? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god ah. no you know what oh god this one's hard ah. i know it's really hard because snow gloves that would be so cool no but then right. magic eight balls you could ask the boobs questions yes, and, like find exactly. out what's up so, uh, all right I'm, I'm gonna go ahead and choose the eight ball just because i feel like the snow globe would only be fun half the year you know what's a what's a fucking snow globe when it's like 100 outside you know so true I'm, I'm gonna go with the eight ball because I mean, it would just be like I, I could buy this this chick a bra that would just show like the end of the eight ball, like just the answer, <laughs> and be like, yo yo, you, you want to go eat at like Burger King, like slap her boob, <laughs> and then just look at her boob, be like, nope, all right, next question. Yeah, no, I I'm for the same <laughs> thing because you would never have to flip another coin. Exactly. Either someone just like smack your boob and you'd be good to go. <laughs> Just like jiggle her around a little bit. <laughs> yeah. Just look at the answers. That'd be awesome. That'd God, be now so I want funny. that a lot. That would be so cool. And it would be, um, the snow globe would be really heavy. It so would. You'd get back problems. There's no that, reason to have that. Whereas magic eight balls are really light. Yeah, yeah. No. I think we got the right answer on this one. I think so, definitely. Although both are epic. They are. Oh, God. Half woman with those. And then half horse with the tin. Oh, 
Do you imagine the fucking bukkake we could have with this thing? With a crippled person who's watching. And but he can't participate because no, he's falling off his wheelchair. <laughs> but he's like clapping and cheering you guys on. <laughs> oh my god. The thumbnail on this video. Oh god. Oh, it could be epic. It will. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed that, and uh, thanks for all the support on these last, what, however many would you rather. You guys really like them, and you like and favorite them like crazy, I've noticed, so I can tell you guys really, really enjoy them. And, um, you know, answer the questions yourself in the comment section below. We love to see what you guys have to say about the questions we've just asked, and uh, thank you, Mr. iTryer. Would you like to end the video? Yeah, thank you, and uh, thank you Kelly's channel, man. Uh, these are like the best videos ever, so keep on supporting him because I want to be back here next week. Hells yeah. All right, have a good day, everyone. See you. Yes.